guys, here we are again. Uh, we're going to continue with where we're going to stop. I don't know where I'm going to end up, but um, I'm hoping the engine works at the end. You know, I'm not sure. But I've got a little bit of here, but I'm not going to use this stuff because um, I just can't work with it. And I might do things tightly handed, so don't worry. Okay then, let's, I don't know if you can hear me through that noise, but let's do this. This is the part I don't like because I'm not sure if my parting tools are working right. But here we go again. Snapped again guys, my parting tools are no good. I've used the hacksaw to cut this, now I'm just going to try and face it off a little bit. This ridge I made here, I'm going to take it off and I'm going to just go, maybe go back a little bit more. This is it guys, so I'm going to drill the hole right through the middle there on a driller. I'll just do it off camera. So guys, this has to be, sorry, this one has to be offset by 316, like that. Um, not exactly sure how I'm going to do it, but what I'm, what I'm going to do is find the center hole here and offset by 316 and drill a hole there and that should fit this in theory and then I'm going to um, try and uh, silver solder a little bit there so it should hold it and then obviously uh, I've got to drill and tap this hole there and that one should be made then oh. 
So this is it guys, set up now to uh, this rubber solder. I don't think I'm that brave to do this one, so I'll let my mate do it. So this is it guys, it's done now, it's been silver soldered, as you can see it, and um, it's supposed to be 3 eighths of an inch, sorry 3 sixteenths of an inch offset there, a little bit crash there, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to use this side, I'm going to drill a, drill a hole and tap it now, so it holds the uh, holds it into place. So guys, this is it. Um, I've drilled and tapped that hole there, but I was, I was worried about how to drill a hole that size in this place because I don't have that drill bit size. And my mate told me about this stepper drill. I will drill one side of it, uh, of the hole, and we're drilling this other side, just making sure it goes in nicely. It's a bit loose, but you know, it doesn't matter because I think a little bit loose is better than too tight on these things. So we'll try it out. So I'm gonna drill this hole, cut this piece off, See how it goes. So here it is guys, it's been drilled out, it's a little bit rough in there, so I shall clean it up, tidy up a bit. But there you go, see, it's a little bit loose, as you can see that, a little bit loose in there. But you know something I can play with, it's fine. Uh, I was concerned about it, how am I going to do this, or how am I going to make it work, etc. But I'm going to cut this off here, and shape it a little bit there, and cut this off here. The only thing I'm concerned about, I drill and tap uh, something there, something through there to put the rod on, but we can work with that. So this is it guys, I've drilled and tapped a rod in there, about 4 mil, and um, it comes undone. I haven't cut it off yet, as you can see, still length, so I'll find out what length I need before I cut it off. But uh, this part is done now, so I can undo this if I want to. It comes off like this. The thing is guys, um, I might, once I've done it, I might super glue this in there, so it'll be fine. And that's it, so subscribe, thumbs up, and I've run out of time. Thank you for watching.